Showing support for police and firefighters, Brady Williams and Jared Bentley ran across Little Miami's football field Friday. The flags they carried weren't just to honor Williams' father, a police officer, and Bentley as a firefighter. But this was 9-11. That's the only thing it was about, was to honor those police officers and firefighters that lost their lives on 9-11. Brady's father, Scott, says this was never meant to be political, and he says the boys were never told no. And that's just not the case. The athletic director who uh, called my son in the day of the game said, I can't tell you yes and I can't tell you no. We can't take a position either way on you carrying a flag. So he carried the flag. The two players were later suspended indefinitely from Little Miami Athletics. That was followed by outrage in the community and on social media. I mean, these boys were doing something to support their fathers as well as our country. Today, school board members overturned the decision, saying they found motivations behind this display were not political. Afterwards, community members continued to show support for the students by waving American flags as the high school let out. It was clearly a, a support for the fallen heroes, and, and we wanted to let the administration know that it was a no political meeting and, you know, just was basically to support our heroes. The day of 9-11, I don't think there's a reason why they think it should be political. I mean, it's respect. And in Little Miami's statement that was released today, the board president said this matter is now in the hands of the athletic department. In the meantime, Josh Johns, who you just saw there, is planning a rally for the next home game, which is a week from Friday. He tells me he's already heard from FDNY firefighters, the New York Police Department, and also people as far away as UK and Ireland who want to support these boys. Reporting live tonight in Hamilton Township, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.